In this video, I'll be trading from whatever random fruit I find up to the mammoth. Also, to make this more difficult, I'm currently on an alt account and I can only get fruits from either trading or fruit related events. And to start off with, oh wait, fruit detected. Okay, this is perfect. This is perfect, bro. We're about to get our first fruit right now. Hopefully it's good. This is going to determine how smooth this video goes. Okay, we're getting closer, 90 meters away. I see something. Is that glowing? Is that a Buddha? Oh, no way. That's a Buddha. Bro, I, I swear this wasn't scripted. There's no way I could have made this up. We found a Buddha for the first fruit. This couldn't have been a better start to the video. Let me go ahead and store that. With this, we'll be able to instantly trade up to a mythical fruit. But I think we should do something smarter with it. We are breaching the factory in 30 seconds. Oh, say less, bro. We just got the Buddha and now we got the factory already. We're already set up really nicely with the Buddha. But you know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna complain if we get another good fruit off rip. Especially since Mammoth is really overpriced at the moment. So we're definitely gonna need some high tier fruits. All right, let's pack up this core. Dragon Flames. 59,000 health. We almost there. A couple more hits. And there we go. We got the sand fruit. Cheeseburger looking at fruit. Let's go ahead and store that thing. Right now we have a Buddha and a sand fruit which already sets us up very nicely now let's go ahead and look for some trades but before that i went and asked the blockers discord what mammoth is worth right now and everyone's saying lower equal to dragon or about a dragon so now that gives us a good idea of what's going to be required to get the mammoth but i think starting off we should try to trade up this sand I'm trading sand for dark fruit any takers any takers i think this is a pretty realistic trade we should be able to find this one okay this dude's sitting down let me go sit down with him let's offer up the sand let's see other player doesn't have enough oh my god okay we might have got oh we got a dark oh wow this dude didn't even say anything he just went other player doesn't have enough space oh my god he's putting in the diamond bro you don't even have enough now he's just flexing his fruits bro don't even have enough space for the sand all right bro that's 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 tough thought we had a trade there bro oh he said in chat let me unstore oh he a real one for real we got a w man sand for the dark all right our first trade up let me toss him a thank you you a true g my boy he said no problem yes sir okay so now we traded up to the dark fruit and i'm pretty sure with the dark fruit we could trade up to a magma and this is really important because the magma can easily trade up to a quake and then we'll be able to get our first legendary that way i don't really want to use the gotch in this video mainly fruit events such as notifier factory or pirate raid trading dark for magma please someone trade me soon let me just go in the chair hopefully someone will show up a few moments later okay this guy's sitting in the chair right here let me go ahead and sit down let me put up my dark let's see what he has to offer what fruits do you have oh wait, he offered up ghost would you give ghost for my dark will you show me your fruits bro all i have is this i guess he doesn't want my offer all right that's a l dead in the water oh wait he said i'll make you a deal bacon you give me dark i give you ice and flame <sighs> that's a trade down but i would end up with more fruits all right i'm gonna have to pass maybe i need another fruit in order to trade up to magma okay we potentially got a trade i've been looking for like <sighs> other player doesn't have space. oh my god we may have to change up our game plan wait is that a light fruit right in front of the gotcha ah uh, but i can't accept free fruits i forgot okay well i'm just gonna go ahead and drop that right there i'm making my way over to danger level six in the middle of the sea you guys are probably wondering wondering why i'm doing this well recently they added a curse ship event that spawns at level six and if you defeat those they have a chance of dropping a physical ghost fruit i can get my hands on the physical ghost fruit that'll set us up very nicely all right here we are okay now we just need to find the curse ship event i don't know the rarity of it spawning this might take us a little while a few moments later okay we got a ship raid right here these also have a small chance of dropping a devil fruit so i think it's worth fighting these okay let's just go ahead and just try my best to fight them hopefully my ship doesn't die in the time i needed it bro doing this on an alt account was such a bad idea bro like i have no of my op stuff dragon flames we only got fragments ah we didn't get the damn fruit and my boat's about to die oh so much for that our boat just died oh. Wait, did they update the level six zone? That is daytime. It looks a lot more brighter than it used to. It used to be like pitch black. There's a sea event right there. Perfect timing. What are these sharks doing? Get on my boat, you damn sharks. Hold on. Do these sharks have a chance to drop the ghost fruit? They drop bones. Okay, that's weird. All right, I need to hurry up and kill these things before my damn boat goes dead. Let me switch to the dark blade. I think the dark blade is probably better for this. I think these things have a high chance of dropping the ghost fruit. Got to hurry up and defeat this thing. Why are there so many NPCs? Bro? Oh my God. This is stressful. All right, all right. We're getting tons of experience and materials or not able to beat the damn ship. My ship's about to die, bro. There's like 100 health left. Nah, bro. Oh my God. We had the damn ghost ship and my ship broke. Oh, fruit respawn in the game. Perfect timing, bro. Things have been going terribly, but this is W. Get to this before anyone else because I am in a public server. It's got to be on Total Mansion, most likely, or maybe Cake Land. I had to get this before anyone else. Nothing's been going our way, bro, as far as getting these trades. Here we go. Less than 100 meters away. What is it over here? Oh, no way. We've been looking for the magma fruit the whole time when we get the magma fruit, bro. Oh my God, bro. That is a W. Now that we have the dark plus the magma fruit, I don't think we should have any troubles trading this up to a quake. Or maybe we could even trade 
trade that up to a lub or a spider. Okay, I put in trading magma plus dark for spider. This dude sat in chair. Okay, hold on. Let me put the dark plus the magma. Magma went up in value. It's 960k now. I remember it used to only be like 800k. Oh, he put quake in love. Is he actually about to accept this? No shot. He put an annoyed face in chat. Bro, you're the one that sat down. You knew my offer. Rubber plus barrier for my dark and magma. I'm gonna have to decline, bro. bro what the hell? Is that EDP in Bloxers? Bro, I thought you was arrested. What you doing in Bloxers, my boy? And he talking about some and have cupcakes what all right boys i had to settle a little bit after like an hour of looking this is the best trade i could find magma for quake thank you to this guy sniper monkey 026 or whatever his name is he actually said he was down to trade this to me finally got up to a legendary fruit in terms of trades although i'm not gonna lie that wasn't that much of a trade up for my magma that actually might be a trade down since magma increased in value pirates have been spotted approaching castle i'll say less you cannot access this portal wait i don't have the portals on this thing oh my god i don't have permanent oh my gosh bro am i literally about to miss out on a pirate raid that is insane okay i hopped into the second scene someone in chat said i have spider in chat okay hold on let me go seal this trade up wait is he just willing to trade the spider for the quake i get to trade up to a spider and keep my dark still that is insane w man that's also a third trade of the eight hour period so we only have two more to go and that'll wrap up our first day but this is looking nice spider we have buddha and dark a few moments later mm, i got a bit of an interesting trade here oh damn he actually declined okay we may have a trade on my hands this guy already has spider bro i literally just put in chat trading spider plus dark for phoenix oh my god the trading community Ooh. all right after almost an hour straight of looking i think we finally got a trade spider for phoenix here we go spider for phoenix bro it took me a long time to get this but we do got this phoenix though appreciate you my boy perfect timing too breaching the factory in 30 seconds i'll say less gotta try to get first by any means necessary boom boom oh, oh it's gonna be hard to get first damage with all these people in here, bro. Please, 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 please. I just want to get first. I just want to get first, bro. Place, first, place. Oh, we didn't get it. Okay, I'm actually not that upset about it. The person in chat said it's smoke fruit. Fruit detected. Okay, okay. It's 400 meters away. Praying that something good. We need something good to get that next W trade. All right, bro. It's only 26 meters away. Let's go ahead and build up the suspense for this, bro. What do you think it is, boys? Oh, it's a love fruit. That's actually really good. This is 1.3 million values. With the love, phoenix, and dark fruit, we should 100% be able to get a rumble or a portal. And just confirm the rarity. I asked people in the Bloxers Discord they said i'd be able to get a portal or a rumble most likely hopefully someone replies soon i feel like this is actually a solid trade bro someone in chat said more w what do you mean more you're not even gonna be able to trade me if i put more in this guy right here said he has portal i'll say less bro he just added on but i have all your fruits oh why didn't you just start with that dog why you gotta troll me like this poof i was on my main right now bro Ooh, i'd pack you up to the next tuesday bro man that trade got me a little mad but we do have another fruit detected over here so i wanted to do a trade before we got another fruit notifier but i mean it's already here you know what i'm saying might as well go after it probably not even gonna be anything good for real i think i just saw it in the corner of my eye i believe that's a bomb yeah that is a bomb bro i'm not even gonna store this i'm gonna be honest i ain't even storing that garbage having a really hard time trading up from this phoenix in love it doesn't seem like they have really high demand especially according to this website right here it says that this phoenix is only a five out of ten on demand and love is also a five out of ten but if i added in buddha plus phoenix i might be able to trade up to something like a venom maybe we should go for that instead hopefully we'll have better luck with this because i know buddha is over hyped to hell seems like we already got a good trade right here bro let me put up my buddha and then phoenix and he's offering venom three two one yes sir boys that's completed our five out of five for the daily he said thank you no thank you bro that's gonna be very helpful for us bro especially since venom is a high demand fruit but that is the last trade we can do for another eight hours i'm either gonna sleep or grind some more fruit notifiers okay so we're now in day two of trading i think the move we need to try to go for is to try to trade this love and dark up to a gravity and then this venom up to a spirit with gravity plus spirit that'll be two mythicals which will give us a very good chance of getting that mammoth trading love and dark for gravity i'm also trading venom for spirit if in case anyone wants that all right after a while of looking i got this trade from this guy named mr mama he's accepted my love and dark offer for gravity this is only a small upgrade because gravity has like literally no demand but anyways now we have two mythicals gravity and venom quickly found a trade for the venom up to spirit there we go that's our second trade but i'm not gonna lie with just spirit and gravity we're not gonna be able to trade up to much we're gonna need at least a portal or a rumble and then we can trade up to dough so our next step is we need to start farming some factories and notifiers we detected hold on 700 meters away let's go turtle turtle mansion turtle mansion oh here we go uh oh there's a dude down there hope he doesn't see the fruit oh my god it's a damn shot bro i'm not even picking that up we've been having bad luck man let me go ahead and toss that in the ocean well should just spawn in game okay say let's oh my god it's just a damn ghost fruit bro still gonna store that though just because you know a fruit's a fruit pirates have been spotted approaching the castle 
God, say less. This is what I need. This is our second chance to get a decent fruit, bro. But these things usually last pretty quick. And we get the light fruit. Okay, that's actually not too bad. Light plus ghost could maybe give me like a quake or spider at max. Actually, I thought of a new strategy. Also, just as we speak, the blocks roots just spawned in game. Hold on, let me go ahead and try to go for this, bro. And it's perfect that it's on a floating turtle as well. Okay, we're 70 meters away. Where is it at? Where is it at? Oh, 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 no way. No shot. No shot. We just got a portal fruit. Oh my gosh, bro. We have gotten so lucky time and time again this video, bro. This is actually perfect. Everything's aligning perfectly. After we do these trades with the spirit of gravity and get the dough, we'll be able to instantly trade up to the mammoth. Trading portal plus life for Buddha. Someone please accept this is actually a W trade. All right, so it took me a long time, but I managed to get a trade for buddha for my portal and light the guy that i was talking to in the trading discord said this would be a good trade and that i should be able to find it easily three two one there we go trade completed this trade is going to be huge for us because now we have spirit gravity and buddha also i just saw he threw a quake in there he didn't even need to do that the next best bet is to trade this spirit plus buddha up to doe and then we trade that doe plus gravity and quake to mammoth we're getting so close to our goal now a few minutes later all right boys i think i found someone that's got doe let's go let's go ahead and put my spirit in buddha hopefully he puts up his doe i hope i ain't getting trouble for this one yes sir doe get it boys let's get it bro we can get this trade we are only one trade away way from getting the mammoth three two one yes sir oh my gosh bro thank you man this is crazy the finish line is like in close reach now man two days of doing this we've been grinding out here man we have been out here grinding let's try to find that last trade now my one leverage with this trade is that the mammoth fruit is low demand and its price is fluctuating a lot so i could find someone that's willing to cut me a deal trading dough gravity and quake for mammoth come on someone respond soon man i've hopped like 20 different servers a few moments later meet shadow lobber 005 he actually randomly reached out to me asking if i wanted a mammoth and i said i got a trade for you so here he is now you got the mammoth my boy oh he just pulled it out <laughs> Yo. oh my gosh bro all the trading we did leading up to this all the notifiers the the, the, the factory farms the pirate raids it's all about to end right here bro he put up mammoth and ghost say less bro it's about to be it the final trade of the video bro the final trade oh my gosh bro Whew. three two one yes sir mammoth on the fifth trade of the video bro thank you so much shadow lobber bro you a real one we did it man trading up to mammoth in one video